known mark B slash AR instead of B. Right. Um, so the corrective map was uh, printed. It's available for distribution. And I, I think this is minor because the um, wording in the published ordinance that itself is very clear that the two sections in question are to become part of the B zone. We don't have anything such as an AR common. slash B right. zone. Right. Sort of sort of uh, contradictory. Mayor, I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm the Lawrence attorney, and we're good with that change as well. Do me a favor, Mayor. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and I'm with Becker and Holly Paul, and we're, we're representing National Realty. And we spoke about this issue and asked them to change, and our claim is fine. Okay, great. Thank you. I just want to make that clear. All right, good. Any comments from the public?
If Mr. Lilo was not in agreement with the information that I shared last meeting, then he should have spoken up for himself and not hide behind your apron. He was standing next to me at Pickle Park on Monday, and he made no attempt to speak to me, to me about my comments. I will go on to say that Mr. Lila given the opportunity, was given the opportunity to debate Liz Duffy and Ben Smith to demonstrate their qualifications as township committee members. They made every excuse why they couldn't make themselves available. Quite frankly, in my opinion, which once again I'm entitled to, based on their lack of communication, I don't think they're qualified for this job. Also, Mr. Schoenfeld, it's my understanding that you've been on suspension from the squad since last October, which you failed to mention along with your life membership. So when it comes to criticizing others and their behavior, I think you need to look at yourself first. Thank you. May I please reply to that? <clears throat> Madam Mayor, please um, Mr. Oriyama, I don't have a prepared uh, statement, uh, as you obviously took the time to prepare, but I think I'd like to clear the record on a couple of things here. First of all, I find it offensive that you would dress down a member of the public, serving the public in the way you did the last meeting. Um, secondly, I think you have turned this into a political circus that I was accused of here a while back, quite frankly. I find that offensive. And I think the fact that you have chosen not to run maybe suggests that you're not qualified. I would just like to address uh, Mr. Schoenfeld's um, comments about the parade and community. Day. And, uh, to my thinking, and, and I may be mis misinformed here, but I have always viewed them as two separate events. Memorial Day Parade is a parade to commemorate Community Day is Community Day. There, in the past, we haven't even done them on the same day. We've had community separate, so that within the past couple of years, they've been combined. But I don't see Community Day as a Memorial Day celebration so much as it is a Community Day celebration. That's just my understanding. So I see them as quite different. Um, in response, um, I'd like to say that um, I only responded to what was told to me about integrity and honesty. That's how I responded. And secondly, I am up for the job because Mr. Gordon, you told me you no, served no more than, than six years. I've served 12 years. That's precisely the reason why we need new leadership on this township committee because people have been around too now. <laughs> Mayor Ford, I would. Do I have a second? Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye.